Hello, welcome to this live session. My name is Stephen from the library, and with me is Zach Woolwich. Um, Zach, what is your role at In Holland? Yeah, I'm a lecturer here in, uh, in Diemen, uh, tourism management, and I also uh, conduct research regarding technology and education. Okay, and what is your role concerning information literacy? Yeah, well, my students uh, need to deliver a beautiful uh, thesis at the end of year four, and it has to be of a sufficient level. So my role as a teacher is to support them in getting to the right level and finding the right information and using it the right way. Okay. And uh, which level of students are you concerning now? And which project? Yeah, at the moment I have first year students and I've got third year students okay. and I've also got graduation students. Okay. I know from a colleague, yeah. uh, Irene, yeah. who's doing tourism management, that you are, uh, well, focusing on uh, something, subject, it's called destination management. Yeah. It's, it's really difficult for me to understand. Yeah. Hopefully the students okay. will know a lot more about it. They know about, about it. it, they know about okay, it. Okay, but uh, how can we find the information in the cloud collection of in Holland, in the yeah. library? I'd love to know that. So maybe you okay. can take me through the, through the library? Uh, I would love to. Uh, I think the first one to do is to go to the library website. All right. This is, okay. So, so here is the library, yes. uh, which I've um, found via Insight, and I've put in here, Destination management, that's the subject that I'm, okay. Yes. So I click on uh, search here. Yes. Uh, one of the first steps is to know, okay, I'm looking about destination management. What do I already know about destination hmm. management? So what kind of information you would like your students to find yeah. in our cloud collection? Yeah, there's many subjects it could be. It could be yes. about what is a destination management organization or destination management at a particular Location okay. or trends on destination. Location. Okay. Uh, so we have a search string which is called destination management, and uh, in the cloud uh, collection, you have in in, in the website mm. uh, some options to refine your search. Right. I got eight hundred and seventy thousand here. Yes, that's too that's many. Yeah. I okay. think uh, we will try to manage well maybe ten percent of that. Great. Uh, one of the options is that okay, I'm looking for an uh, article Great. about uh, destination management. Like I so I can click on journal article. Journal article, yes. okay. And then I got 266,000, okay. all right. Okay, so that's one third of the... Yeah. Well, for instance, if you were looking about uh, Facebook as a destination marketing tool. Great, interesting. Well, then you can click on the option on the right, save this item. Save this item, yes. okay. And Great. now we do some Harry Potter, but this is live. Great. So this is the magic stick. This one over here goes into my saved items that yes, little folder. And that folder that directs you to uh, our uh, citation tool. Uh, and you can use that one uh, on every place where you are. So not only here in the building, yeah. but 24 7. And it's called RefWorks. That's, that's RefWorks. Okay. Yes, that's RefWorks. We, we were talking about yeah, it. I set up an account already. Yes. So the last step when you have found a reliable source is yeah. how to cite that source. Okay. And you can do that via RefWorks. So do I, uh, how you do can, I get into RefWorks Well, here? you can sign up. Okay, I'm so already you, in, so you, I so can. Your students have to make a, a new account for RefWorks right. using their in Holland uh, okay. user. So now I think I'm in at RefWorks. So yes. I go back here. You go click on the option, and then RefWorks opens. Uh, it recognizes you right. uh, as Zach Wolfit. And what it has done is that the, the, the source you have found yeah. in, in, in Summon, the website of the library, is important now in right. RefWorks. And you click, yes, click you have select that one, and then you can create a bibliography. Create the bibliography. And you have to do that in the right uh, citation form. And for international, it's well, APA, APA 6. 6. Great. That's You're using right. APA yep. 6. Okay, well, Fantastic. in black, that. you have the whole IPA. Great. So that gets me a, a really nice uh, citation from a, from a document. Yes. And also a reliable source called Tourism Management. Great. But I think there was also another journal you were talking yeah, about. Yeah, I was looking at, uh, it was called the Journal of, let me just see here, sorry. Um, we called it the, so you got the Journal of Destination Marketing and Management. Yes. This is one of the top journals. Here it is, yeah. Oh, okay. And you I think that's an important source for your students? Absolutely. Okay, well, you can see that we have an access via a database called Science Direct. Mm -hmm. So, in Holland has a lot of license on databases. Yeah. And in this database, you can find articles or journals. Okay. And now you have a, a direct link to the Journal of Destination Marketing and Management. So, how do I, get, I click on it here? Is that yes. Click on that one. Okay. 
So here I am inside the journal, is yes, that right? Yes, and what you can do, okay, I want to find something about the latest issue. So you click okay. on the option. And let's so, say you uh, you scroll down the page and you find an interesting article. Okay, let's say that this article, you can... Click on that one? Yes, you have like, full text access. So I can download the PDF if I want, or yes. I can just click on this here no. and have a look and see what we've got. Yes. Okay. Great. And you also got the option site yeah. on the right. And Where is the site? Well, you have to go down. Uh, have to go down a bit, yeah. Yes. And then Citing you, articles, yeah. Well, but you can also, if you click on the option export. Export, export okay. Yes, save to you can save to RefWorks. Right. Okay. So it goes via a database mm -hmm. on where we have, uh, which database we have a license on, as in Holland. Yeah. Now you're uh, redirected back okay. to your RefWorks account. Here it is. Look. Yes. Great. You can also so, do that via Google Scholar. Okay, can you show me how to do that? Uh, you go back to the library site. Back to the library. Yes. Great. Search in the collection. Search in the collection. Yes, right. and we have also, well, maybe you can go to the international environment. That's All right. Then you can click on library. Great. And you have search help. And the yeah. second option is internet search tips. Correct. If you click on that one, you have direct access on the middle of your screen to Google Scholar. Great. Right. You use the same search stream, uh, so destination management. Let me do uh, destination. Hey, what, what is working here? What, what? Yeah, there's a whole bunch of options here. So Google Scholar is very smart. Yeah, I'm going to choose Facebook because I like to see what's going on with social media. Okay. So here. And this one, yeah. you can read it full text okay. at in Holland. So this article, yes. I search through. Now what's the advantage? And what you can do is now click on the uh, worldwide recognition. Yeah. It's called Make a Citation. Is that this one here? Yes. These two. What, what is it called, that sign? So, citing. Okay. Yes, and then you choose APA. Right. And then you go to RefWorks. Yeah. And then from Google Scholar, yes, your export. citation is import, exported. Okay. So here. And then you can import it it's gone into in, RefWorks. It's gone in. So now I've got three. There you yes. go. This is just and a few seconds ago. What is here. also very important, so it's not only a citation tool, Look, but you, same can, you, can share, yeah. you can share all your information okay. which you have found. So I'm going to share a folder on RevWorks. So I could share it with you. Great. I know a lot more about it. Thanks for the quick demonstration. I appreciate it. Hopefully, my advice was worth it. It certainly was. Thanks okay. very, very much indeed. So I would like to know from all the students here. Was this a useful explanation of how to find reliable sources, for instance, in this case about destination management? What do you think, Zach? Yeah, for me, it was very helpful, and I'm really going to use the RefWorks and try the different search options and, of course, share it with my students. Thanks very much. And not only your students, also your fellow colleagues, oh, because they I'm, have to be also information literate. I will never Otherwise, forget my colleagues. <laughs> luckily. Fantastic. I will see you in spring 2020. Great. Okay. Thanks very much. Thank you, Zach. Okay.